Hi guys, Katie from MummyNoseReviews.com. I am here with Logan being silly and I've got my little Noah down here. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about um, some postpartum belts. Uh, there are a lot of different options out there. A lot of people have heard of some of the bigger name brand ones. These can run you anywhere from $20 up to close to $200 depending on what you're looking for and what you need. Uh, I got this from a company called Mama Way Postpartum Belly Bands. I am in love with this and I will absolutely explain why. Okay, first of all, I'm not postpartum anymore. Um, I'm My baby's eight months. In fact, I'm going to pick him up and show you my big monster real quick. Come here, monster. This is my big monster. We're all dressed up, getting ready for Halloween in a couple of days. Say hi! This is Noah. He is eight months now. He's getting massive, big, and chunky, okay? I, ugh, as he pulls onto my hair, still have a mommy gut because I did not have a postpartum belt. When I finally got one, I hated it, and let me explain why. I'm gonna step back for a second. So see, you can see I got my little bit of a mommy gut still going on. Um, I try to go to the gym a couple days a week, so, you know. All right, here's my issues with postpartum belts. Usually when you put them on, they're really hard, okay? And so as you sit down, they cause these bends and wrinkles. And as they bend and wrinkle, it pushes into your skin more. This is completely loose and bendable, so I can actually move around in it. It does have these two Mommy, little extra Mommy, that's you, Daddy. You. That is me. So as you can see here, it is a little that's bit wider down at the bottom to help with your hips. Um, I recommend using these usually around like some sort of fabric as well. So I'm going to go ahead and lift my shirt a little bit. I have a white shirt on underneath. So you can use like a spaghetti strap shirt or a tank or whatever. Um, normally you want to do the sitting down in a bed because that way everything kind of sucks in a little bit and sits where it's supposed to be. So I'm actually going to go ahead and lower this down so you can see it better just because it's not going to work very well right now. So, First thing you want to do, I got mine in a large because these always usually run a little smaller, but their large is pretty large. Mommy, so definitely you're daddy to you. I am. So you want to unvelcro one of these extra sides, okay? As you lay down, you want to lay flat on your back, pull the side that does not have the velcro on it all the way over. Don't want to do it too tight to where you can't breathe, but you want to do it tight enough to where it works. And then you wrap this one up and over, okay? Here's number one thing I like about it. It fits from here up to here. Some of them will usually fit from about here to like here. So you're really not getting that upper and back fat area. Now, I have a large. I feel like I have a little wiggle room. That's why I love these suckers. You take these things, which don't mind my cape, is tight on the back here, okay? Come on. And you wrap that sucker around. And I have a little extra tight support around here. This helps pull it all in a little bit, makes it easier. And look at this, look at this, watch this. So now it's sucking it in, which helps to kind of push it so that way, right after you've had a baby, everything's not just kind of yeah, so hanging out. You. Yes, that is me tucking. I should probably move my cape or take it off so you can see this. Sorry, it's, you know, Halloween time. We're all Why are you to you? I Why are you to bend you? and stretch. Oh, and do this thing without it bunching up or causing those tight bends. Mama, Absolutely why, why you, love. Mommy, why are you done doing I'm this? talking to myself so I can do a review on this awesome, cool product. She has this. That is that, yes. So, um, right after you have a baby, you want to usually put these on and keep it on for about a month or two. The longer, obviously, you have to take it off to shower and sleep. You don't want to wear it to the point in which you feel like you can't breathe. You don't want it that tight. But you definitely want it enough to be able to kind of help push everything back in. And this is supposed to help um, make things a little easier to go back to where it was. So, I have been wearing mine on and off for about a week now, and I can say it's very comfortable. I love it. It is 
definitely, definitely well worth the money. Um, this one you can get on Amazon Prime um, yeah. for $19.95. And of course, if you have Prime, it's free shipping. So it's about the same price as all the other normal ones out there. But it's a better quality and I really like it. I like that it's not bunchy and, and bendy. I feel like I can actually wear it more throughout the day. I also feel like I can wear it underneath clothes um, without it being very noticeable. There are some, excuse me, um, postpartum bands where it's quite obvious you've got something underneath it. So. Anyhow, absolutely love it, absolutely recommend it. Make sure you um, follow the link to go over to my blog so you can read more about it. I will leave details and a link as to where to find it. So, love it, thank you so much. And for all you mamas out there, keep up the good work. Eight months on, or nine months to grow a baby, at least nine months to get it all off. Do not be discouraged, you are beautiful the way you are. And just get some confidence in yourself. And if this helps you get the confidence, do it. So, love you guys all, we'll talk to you later, bye.